Well, I think it's just really rewarding um, being titled that. I feel like um, it's rewarding because I know like the hard works me and my teammates have um, put in the gym and it just feels like, you know, it wasn't for nothing. I um, not only got like that title, but I feel like we also advanced and got the biggest conference, you know? So there's just so many things that um, came with that. So I just really appreciate my team getting me here and the coaches as well, so. One, I think just her presence, you know, she has a very strong presence even without playing. I think she has a strong presence just by her demeanor and body language, um, her energy, her fight, like for every ball. Um, blocking, she's just, she's not satisfied. She just wants to move every ball. She's not that satisfied with just touching. So just that, just her, how she wants to be, I guess. Um, I think she's one of the few middle blockers right now. I, I'm gonna say in the NCAA that goes back, serves, plays defense. You know, if, if we had to put our serve back to pass, I, I think she could pass too, um, but yeah. She's like almost an all around middle blocker. I mean, it was it was cool hearing from Coach Rob today, just telling me that I deserve it and it's nice. So that's how much it means to me. <laughs> I know Coach Rob and um, Noreen is just like, I mean, watching her when I was like in high school and knowing that I was gonna come here was always a really big part of my motivation and trying to work hard so that I could be as good as her one day, so. I think she's, she's I think she's, her ceiling, she hasn't reached her ceiling yet. That's what I think. Um, and again, it comes back to, you know, how much you want to be open to being coached um, and open to feedback from your coaches. Her defense had to pick up and she's definitely, you know, playing some defense. She's a, one of the shorter setters, not short, but just the shorter setters. Um, I think she's touching some balls. I say, hey, you just, all you got to do is touch balls. Um, but she's definitely, she's definitely grown within a couple years, and I, I think her, she can get even better. I guess when I first came here, like my only thought was like, what do I can do to help the team? I'll do. And I didn't really care what my role was gonna be like on off the court. And I think that's what helped me get to where I am now, because like, I just wanted to do everything for the team and work hard for them, so. I just feel super like grateful um, to even be able to like be in a position that I am to like accomplish this uh, goal. Um, I don't know. I just I think the only word I, the only word I have is grateful that I'm in this like position. So she just goes like I, I don't. There's like something I don't know with Kaylin. She's it's she's winning all of these honors and she's still humble. Like she doesn't, you know, her head, her head is still on her shoulders. She just comes to practice the, the same, um, acts the same. Uh, yeah. Did I think that she was gonna have this impact? No. Coachable, you know, the three players that, you know, we've just, we we're talking about right now, it's just everybody's listening. They're open to feedback, you know, coachable and still humble. I mean, that's always awesome to get recognition like that. I think it's uh, really a testament to everyone in my teammates just pushing me and uh, kind of Coach Rob kind of putting me in that position to be in that spot. The coaches have really been pushing me to try to get um, expand my book of options that I can like hit and stuff and just adding the back row game and adding like all the other stuff that they've been asking me to work on, just different shots and different um, placement things and just trying to score in any way I can, not necessarily always just trying to hit the straight down ball because that's not the game that I play or Hawaii volleyball plays. So I think um, it's really just up to the coaches and then pushing me every day in practice to just find different ways to score. I think she's the biggest, one of the biggest girls in the five, in our freshman, our first freshman class that came in. Um, and each year she's you know, just is showing us different things that she can do. Um, but this year, I think she just kind of went this way right after, I think, the UCLA game. And she's another one that's just coachable. Yeah, we sit in video and we're like, hey, right, this shot is open. Hey, if you kind of open up to this, this one is open for you. You got roll shot here. You know, it's every shot. I don't know how many shots she has, 
She has a high down the line. She can hit the ball down the line. She has a deep corner shot. She has a four to four shot. She has a tip, like roll shot over. I mean, she's she doesn't just have like just one. Um, but I think for the you know those hitters that are five ten, you know they have to they have to have all those shots um, when they're playing against you know six foot three four girls.